Hello, land investors and outdoor enthusiasts. This is Josh from usrecland.com. Uh, as always, please subscribe to the website if you haven't already, usreclandcom uh, That way you'll be the first to know uh, about any discounts. We actually send out a specific email to the website subscribers. It's just our way of saying thank you. Uh, and then also, uh, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification bell so that you're notified immediately of brand new inventory coming down the pipe. All right. Well, let's go ahead. We actually have a special uh, offering for you folks today. All right. So what we're doing, uh, these top four properties. So if you're on the website, it's these top four. We've got Cochise County, Arizona, two Costilla counties. These are acreage plays. For those of you looking at acreage, acreage uh, far and away from the big city lights. These might be one of the properties for you. And then we've also got this uh, Northern Michigan Woods property. It's about an hour or just over an hour from Lake Michigan, I believe. It's a nice little secluded uh, rural subdivided lot. There are other homes in the area, but definitely plenty of room to spread out. So just wanted to talk about these properties. What we're going to do is we're going to offer a 99 day same as cash offering. So for these four, uh, what we, we would be looking at is a 25 to 30% down payment, but then we would give you the flexibility of your, the remaining payments over the next three months. Uh, and you could pay it off early, um, and, but there would be a minimum uh, payment, but it, it just helps some of you folks so you're not paying for a cash deal all in one month and throwing your entire budget out of whack. So we do realize sometimes things are tight. So um, we wanted to get you these properties. Uh, these are some high value properties. They're great deals. Uh, these two here, uh, if you're looking for acreage, if you're looking in the Great Lakes region, Michigan, this is a great little play right here. And if you're looking in the Arizona Cochise County area, uh, this is actually a subdivided uh, platted out lot too. So um, all four of these could also simultaneously be considered investor specials as well. Um, so just wanna take a look at briefly at each one for you. Uh, but again, we're gonna offer 99 days, same as cash financing on these four properties. Okay, so here's the Cochise, Arizona. We're asking 2,500 and it's 0.32 acres. Taxes are 14 bucks. It's zoned residential, which all four of these have a residential zoning category, uh, depending on where it's at. And let's take a look at some of the photos for you. Okay, so you've got some mountain views in the background. There you go. You can see them a little back. And here's the lot right here. Again, it's already been planted, platted, subdivided out. There are other homes. So as homes and folks come in and further develop and build their homes here, uh, the real estate values will go up, meaning the land and the improvements, as well as the land itself. So it, it will help your land investing portfolio if this something like this is in there because they've already started, the city definitely has plans for it if they've planted it out, right? Just a matter of when. Some more homes over here, but you can see here's the lot, all right? So if you're looking for a residential uh, rural living type play um, and you wanna get a, a very, very cheap lot so you can build and focus the money on the actual building of your new home and actually you're in the Sunsite school district area so you have good schools in the area too uh, if you have a family so this might be the play for you and there's the lot here okay there's the lot pin Bisbee Douglas International There you go. You got Walmart's about 12 minutes away. This is actually the southern border. And Tucson is about two hours away, a little over, if you want to go into town. So just wanted to look at that one. And then uh, <clears throat> let's take a look at these Costilla lots. So this one, uh, this is actually, uh, we're asking 17000 or 16999 This is a 40-acre lot. 
and this is off grid, so it's rural living. Rural living applies in the San Luis Valley, but you definitely have the uh, panoramic mountain views in the background, and you're in. You've got wide open spaces. You're away from uh, the hustle and bustle of the big city. Uh, if that's what you're looking for, this is the property for you. Also, uh, with it being multiple acreage, uh, a multiple acreage lot, uh, that's definitely bodes well for an investor lot. And here's an outline of it here. And you can see there's some subdivided areas right around that area too. Right off the road here, just the pin. go give you a little broader view aerial eagle eye view there you can see you've got some terrain here with the mountains so if you like mountain biking running quads or just mountain hiking and things like that, maybe even uh, horses, and there's a lot of outdoor activities in this area. There you go. Let's see if we've got some driving directions for the big towns here. So Pueblo is about just shy of two hours north. And what else we got? Any other driving directions? Colorado City, about an hour and a half to Colorado City. All right, so we got that one for you. So that's a, again, that's a 40 acre lot. We're asking 16,999, 17,000. And it is a 40 acre lot, wide open spaces, uh, great investment property, but also if you wanted to uh, get set up on an off grid uh, homestead or horse ranch, this also might be a very, very workable property for you. All right, so let's take a look at the other Costilla. Now this one, uh, in the same area, it is not contiguous to the 40 acre lot. We can't uh, just combine them. They're not contiguous. They don't have a common boundary, but it is in the same area and they're fairly close to each other. This one we're asking 12,000 or 1199 and it is 16.30 acres. And on this particular property, uh, it's also the same, same deal, wide open spaces. And you actually have uh, some mountain views in the background. Um, if you want to uh, build a, a cabin, a homestead, and you can have your morning coffee looking out at the mountains and the vast expanse being away from people, if that's your uh, prerogative. So let's take a look. There's another good view kind of down the road, not quite down the road, but adjacent to the road here. There you go. And it, it is like a triangular shaped lot. Let's show you, there's the pin here off of County Road 10, or County Road 10 and a half, I believe actually. And let's give you some higher level. There's the, there's uh, the actual lot. All right. And you can see the topography of the mountains over here to the east of 159. Here's the actual property right here. Colorado, New Mexico border to your south. There's the property. And here, just to give you some comps. <clears throat> so 17 acres for 17,000, 16 acres for 45, 20 acres for 20. Uh, 16.3 acres for 45. We're asking 12 for 16.3 acres. And these are, you can check these out yourself uh, in terms of uh, comparables. Also, another one you might try is Zillow. So don't take our word for it. Check it out for yourself. Uh, excellent price on these, especially for buy and hold. But again, um, you, you can get multiple usages out of a piece of property like this. You can build a homestead or a getaway cabin or maybe even a small horse horse ranch out there and then hold that property and you could sell it 10, 15 years down the road. But multiple acreage properties are definitely higher value for buy and hold investors. All right. 
And then let's hit the last property. This is our Montcalm Howard City, Michigan property. So we'll take a look at this one. Excellent price. It is a buildable lot uh, for that. 30, we're asking 3,800 bucks, 37.99. So again, um, we try to pride ourselves on bringing you very well and very economically priced land so that you can focus more of your money on the improvement in the buildings, uh, and however you wanna use the land. So this one, 3,800.33 acres, so exactly a third of an acre. Uh, it is a buildable, like all of these, it's got a residential designation, but for specifics, definitely need to contact the county, depending on what your vision is for the property. That's a picture of the frontage, uh, nice tree. Uh, I would call that a meh, median, median, fairly young tree canopy. Doesn't look like any 50 plus year old trees, but nice little lot. And you'll see this is actually a subdivided, platted out uh, rural place. So there are other homes in the area, but um, it's still got plenty of room. So you're getting in um, on the ground floor in terms of an investment property, if that's what you choose to consider as part of this property as well. Oh, here's off Saginaw Trail. There we go. Just takes a minute to download. There you go. So you can see here's a home here. There's a home. There's a home here. But you can see they've got this divided and subplatted out. And I think there's some more photos of that. Yeah, see. Nice little rural place out in the northern woods of Michigan. This is uh, direct access to the highway here. There you go. See? and Howard City proper. You're just to the northwest uh, of downtown Howard. And let's get a higher elevation. Yeah, here's the property. So you're due west of Saginaw, pretty much due north of Grand Rapids, north northeast. Here's Muskegon. And this is Lansing, Michigan, here. Here's Battle Creek, Kalamazoo, and Detroit right here. So there's the property uh, right in the northern Michigan woods, rural living. And again, I let's see if it shows us. I think you're about an hour or maybe even less than an hour from Lake Michigan. So definitely uh, you, you're getting all the great features of the Great Lakes region with the pine trees and the lush greenery, rocks, um, and the Great Lakes themselves, of course. A lot of great fishing, walleye. Uh, walleye, pike, muskie, smallmouth, uh, panfish, you name it. Uh, these regions are known for high traffic uh, for fishermen, uh, for serious fishermen anyway. <laughs> uh, here's, here's the property at Saginaw Trail. From Saginaw, it's an hour and a half, we'll call it, okay? And then this one, here's the property from Kalamazoo, about an hour, 20 minutes, we'll call it. And that's the property, Muskegon, which is right on Mich Lake Michigan, an hour and two minutes. So you're roughly, a, you're just an hour to Lake Michigan coast. So you could jump in the car, head to the lake for the day, get in the boat, go fishing, or maybe uh, go spend the day uh, at, at local areas shopping and restaurants on the lake and then drive home and to the peace and quiet of your secluded little rural living area. Here's your... Here's the lot location, Lansing, about an hour and a half. And let's see what else we got. Grand Rapids, 30 minutes north. So you're just 30 minutes north of Grand Rapids. If you're looking for a vacation home, a little getaway cabin. So there you have it, folks. So again, we've got those four special offering properties. We're gonna offer 99 days, same as cash with a down payment. So there is a down payment, which is 25 to 30% of the uh, total. And then we're gonna help you out with the 99 days financing. So you have about three months uh, and a little bit of change there uh, to pay it off. So it doesn't uh, tighten up the budget belt too much in any given month. So hopefully that helps some of you folks get into some great uh, discounted properties. Again, we want you to spend your money on the improvement of the land. We don't want you to spend every penny on the land. So hopefully this will work for you and you can realize your entire vision for the properties.
Okay. So we've got the Arizona, we got the uh, Arizona property, Cochise County. We've got the 40 acre Costilla, we're asking 17,000. We've got the 16.30 acre, we're asking 12,000, both in Costilla County and San Luis. Uh, they are not conjoined properties, but they are very close in the same region. And then we also have that last property we looked at, Montcalm, Michigan. It's actually Howard City. You're about an hour away from Lake Michigan, and it's a platted subdivided rural area. So it's perfect if you just want a nice little cabin and a quiet getaway property in the northern woods of Michigan. And you're also not too far away from uh, Great Lakes fishing and other hunting areas. Okay, so give us a call on these properties. Uh, please perform your due diligence. See if they meet your checklist. Only you know what you'd like to do with the property. Make sure that it's allowable. Uh, and then reach out to us and we'll be happy to put the property. We follow a first come first serve basis. The first person that has completed their personal due diligence and is ready to move forward and sign the purchase agreement and coordinate payment, uh, that, those two items will lock the property under contract to you until we finalize the transaction. But we do require a purchase agreement and we have to coordinate the payment. So this is not like buying a home where you just start some paperwork and then you start looking around for the next three months. We would not want you uh, to reach out to us to purchase if you're not ready, because in our opinion, if you haven't vetted the property yet, you're not ready to sign the purchase agreement. We would like you to feel 110% confident moving forward with the property. So please perform your due diligence prior to reaching out uh, to purchase a property so that we can move forward quickly and we're not going backwards uh, during the transaction and we can get it done for you. Okay, well, all right, guys. Well, uh, again, just wanted to bring the special offering. Hope, hopefully these um, help some of you out because we do listen to your feedback and it helps you out, helps get you into a, a property that works for you and your family without having to pay the full cash amount and throw the monthly budget off all in one month. Uh, so hopefully this is helpful to you, but please subscribe to the website, usrecland.com. Uh, and again, we give special exclusive deals to the folks that subscribe to that. That's our way of saying thanks to those guys and gals. And then also please subscribe to the YouTube channel and click the notification bell. That way you'll automatically receive notices every time a new uh, land offering comes down the pipe or a special offer video like this comes down the pike. You'll be the first to know because you'll automatically be notified via the notification bell. All right, well, until next time, happy land hunting, everyone.